All right, everybody. Uh, the fun continues with Lauren Workus from Summer House and DJ James Kennedy from Venice Beach. Behind the bar, it's Bruce Bozzi from Lunch with Bruce on Sirius XM Radio and Channel 102. If you go into the Beverly Hills Palm on North Cannon Drive most days at lunch, you are not only going to see a million superstars and every power, power broker in Beverly Hills, but you'll see Bruce too. And he'll give you a big kiss. <laughs> I am just getting uh, word that the response on Twitter to your song is excellent. Nice. Oh, thank you. It. Thank you. That means People so much. are really, really into it, dude. Wow. That's yeah. Awesome. Oh, some people are calling you White Ray J, which is funny because oh, you said, no. yeah, 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 because you said that. People are saying, I'm living for James Kennedy. James, you were dope tonight. Thank you. Thank people you. are making fun of me being your hype man. <laughs> yes. Um, yes, it's great. It's great. That's awesome. It's all good. Thank you. Uh, congratulations. Thank you, Andy. Um, Thank you, guys. Thank you. I really liked it. You just took two. I mean, can't you take one? <laughs> I wrote the song during Coachella weekend last year. Oh, uh, I bet. <laughs> okay, good. Um, Shep Rose tweeted and said, I've had some fun out in New York with Lauren Workus and Carl, both cool, but how could she expect too much out of the guy? A tiger never changes his stripes. Wow. You Pod know, calling the kettle black. You Shep. know, Shep, I probably shouldn't expect a lot, but you guys don't see there is a lot that isn't shown, and right. we do have a co connection and chemistry, and... I'm just a regular human chick. What can I say? Um, I get it. I totally get it. Um, Chelsea Ingle tweeted, I just watched It's James Kennedy on Andy, and now my boyfriend keeps singing, I don't even know because I just took two. <laughs> So, oh, uh, Titty Contour said, I want someone to look at me the way Andy looks at James Kennedy when he's performing. <laughs> I, lo I love that. I noticed that on the last video I posted. You Your did? face is just so much love. I love it. I love oh. you too, though, Andy. Oh, my God, I love it. Back to the phones. Caller, what's your name and from where are you calling? Hey, caller. Don't leave me hanging. Hi, Hi. it's Patty from Philadelphia. Okay. Um, First, Andy, I want to just tell you, you are fabulous. I Thanks. love you. Thank you. And love you back. my question is for Lauren. Okay. Uh, Hi. Lauren, are you currently in a relationship? Good question. And if so or if not, how are you going to stay clear of toxic relationships? You know, it is a little hard, but I am currently not in a relationship. I'm single. I am open. I am looking for somebody, so send them my way. Um, you know, it is hard sometimes to... You know, stay away. I think every girl has been there, and I'm very open and honest with my feelings. And, you know, I had an attachment with someone, and it was hard to break. I get it. Back to the phones. Caller, what's your name, and from where are you calling? Hey, my name's Eleni. Hey, Eleni. Hey, um, Andy, I love you. I think there's a delay. That's probably why. It's I cool. It's super weird. Just off. charge ahead. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, first I want to tell Lauren that she looks absolutely beautiful tonight. Thank you so much. Not <laughs> do not need to be, like, even thinking about Carl. Like, he can't touch this. <laughs> but for James, um, I'm just wondering if, like, when you guys are looking back on the show, what, like, how is she feeling about it? Is there any conflict? Between me and Raquel? Or was that yeah. even for me? Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah, obviously there is a little bit of uh, conflict issues, you know, C clearly she couldn't be happy watching that back, but again, you know, I'm making mistakes and I'm learning from them, you know, what can I say? Raquel, my best. What, what has been the hardest to relive? I think that jacuzzi scene was the hardest. Uh-huh. Um, I wanted to wait to watch it with James and I started crying. It, it was definitely tough to... Oh. How old are you? Yeah, it was horrible. 23. Are you still in, or did you graduate? I'm graduating this May. Congratulations. <laughs> um, how are you, how old are you, DJ James Kennedy? I just turned 26. Very good. Yes, and we'll be moving in together, actually, when oh. she graduates. Yeah. Nice. And we're getting a dog. <laughs> and you're getting a dog? <laughs> yeah. Oh, James. Not from <laughs> Vanderpump Dogs. No. Oh, I won't uh, say that yet. Uh, just kidding, no, I didn't say that. <laughs> Um, I don't know if you need to plant that flag, sweetie. Um, maybe you should get one from Vanderpump No, Dogs. because we tried already, but she didn't oh. let her get one. Oh, okay. But anyway... Oh, Lisa V wouldn't let you get a dog because she wouldn't didn't... Wouldn't let her get a dog, not me, not me. Oh, oh okay. It was her thing. She All right. said I, have, I had enough on my hands. <laughs> oh, did you have enough on your hands. Yeah, you do. Oh. Yeah. Okay, back to the phones. Call her. What's your name and from where are you calling? <laughs> 
Hey. This is Trudy, and I'm calling from Hilton Head. Oh, gorgeous Hilton Head. I love it. Yeah. Oh, sunset. Well, that lighthouse <laughs> is so gorgeous with the <laughs> red and white stripe, isn't there? Yes. Yeah. Like right? Okay, anyway, back to the phones. I mean, what's your question? <laughs> My question is I haven't for had Lauren. anything to drink. Um, okay, what's your yeah. question for Lauren Hilton Head? I love it there. I. <laughs> I wanted to know, she's always, her sister's always saying how immature she's being about certain things that are going on with Carl, but um, I have to say the tossing of the watermelon was quite the jaw dropper and wanted to know what the conversation was after that happened. You know, my sister likes to make an entrance and she made one, but you know, she has my best interest at heart and it may be a little dramatic, but you know, it's probably a good analogy for Carl. He's either really quite refreshing or you're left picking up the pieces, so. Back to the phones, last call of the night. Caller, what's your name and from where are you calling? Bam. Yes, this is Vivian. I'm calling from Monroe, Louisiana. Hey, Vivian. And I have, hey, Viv. Yes, I love your show, and I have a question for James. Okay. I, I wanted to know, I, I think he's a great guy, and I just wanted Thank to you. know, after Lisa gave him a second chance, why is he starting back drinking so much, uh, <laughs> taking a chance <laughs> on nothing? Oh, no, he as he grabs his drink. drink. <laughs> and I this should mention. Soda. She, she like, called me right before this. It's like, his, it's like his 20th chance she's given him, right? Yes, and, and he needs to understand he's got a lot going for him, but this will be the one thing that will take him down for good. Wow, good I just wish You know, could... she sounds like, like my grandma. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you. I appreciate the words. Okay. Well, I'll get, a hold, I'll get a hold on it, I promise. I won't let you down. I, I just, that, that is the lamest, that is like tissue paper. Yeah, it, it's that? like nothing. What should I say, you know? Well, you just took two, I guess, right? <laughs> yeah. He just drank two. I have a new track on SoundCloud that will explain my drinking habits currently. I want to thank Lauren, James Kennedy, and Bruce Fossey from the Bomb for more. Click around BombaTV.com. Good night, everybody. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.